Writing citations is painful. Hi there, my name is Brian Collins. Welcome to the Become a Writer Today channel. In this video, I'm going to profile a Grammarly feature which will save you a lot of time with your citations. Basically, Grammarly has rolled out an automatic citation generator, which is starting to work across a number of popular websites. To use the automatic citation generator, you simply need to install Grammarly to your Chrome browser. Now you can visit a couple of different websites. It works like this. I've looked up an article about Joan Didion on Wikipedia. She's a famous American author. If I wanted to cite this particular page, I simply click in this box where it will appear at the bottom of the web page. When I click on Get Citation, Grammarly will automatically present an APA cited reference that I can add to my writing app of choice. In this case, that's Ulysses. So I've pasted this in and it's automatically cited. Now I know some writers don't use APA. No problem, let's go back to Grammarly. Simply click on MLA and you can copy the text as or cite it as MLA and paste this into your writing app of choice. You can do the exact same thing for Chicago Manual of Style. Now there are a couple of other different options that you can set. Do you want to cite on Wikipedia all the time or do you find this annoying? Well, you can turn that off too. Now I've tested the Grammarly Citation Manager on various publications around the web. Support is still being rolled out so your mileage may vary. However, I visited journals.sagepub.com and I was pleasantly surprised to find it worked pretty easy. The citation button appeared at the bottom of the screen. I was able to get my citation, Chicago Manual of Style, and paste it into my writing app of choice. At the time of recording this video, the citation generator is being supported by a number of journals around the web. However, Grammarly is still rolling out support for some other websites that you may use, including news websites. This is the Irish Times, which is our national newspaper in Ireland. When I visited this article, the citation generator button did not appear yet. So there is a workaround if this happens and you need to generate a citation pretty quickly. Grammarly has a citation generator on grammarly.com forward slash citations. It's a little bit more manual. So you're going to select your citation style, which I've already done. You're going to put in your source. In this case, it's a newspaper article. Uh, you're going to put in all of the details. So in this case, I'm going to put in today's date. I'm going to paste in the article uh, title. Uh, I'm going to put in the name of the newspaper. I'm going to put in the year. And now I have a full citation that I can copy. I have not added the contributor because there was no byline for this particular article, but I could copy this and add it to uh, my bibliography or I could simply copy this for an in-text citation. And of course I can change all of these settings as well. So there you go, it's a compelling feature if you find yourself using a lot of journals and articles online for your writing that could save you a good bit of time. And until support rolls out for uh, news websites and other publications, just simply use the citation manager. If you want more resources about Grammarly, I'll include some links below this video. 